In computational complexity, problems that are in the complexity class NP but are neither in the class P nor NP complete are called NP intermediate, and the class of such problems is called NPI. Ladner's theorem, shown in 1975 by Richard Ladner, is a result asserting that, if P NP, then NPI is not empty, that is, NP contains problems that are neither in P nor NP complete. Since the other direction is trivial, we can say that P equals NP if and only if NPI is empty. Under the assumption that P and P, Ladner explicitly constructs a problem in NPI, although this problem is artificial and otherwise uninteresting. It is an open question whether any natural problem has the same property. Schaeffer's dichotomy theorem provides conditions under which classes of constrained Boolean satisfiability problems cannot be in NPI. Some problems that are considered good candidates for being NP intermediate are the graph isomorphism problem, factoring, and computing the discrete logarithm, list of problems that might be NP intermediate, factoring integers, isomorphism problems, graph isomorphism problem, group isomorphism problem, group automorphism, ring isomorphism, ring automorphism, computing the rotation distance between two binary trees or the flip distance between two triangulations of the same convex polygon. The turnpike problem of reconstructing points online from their distance multiset, discrete log problem and others related to cryptographic assumptions. Determining winner in parity games. Determining who has the highest chance of winning a stochastic game. Numbers in boxes problems. Agenda control for balanced single elimination tournaments. Not triviality. Assuming any XP is not equal to EXP. Padded versions of any XP complete problems. Problems in TFNP. Intersecting monotone SAT. Minimum circuit size problem. Deciding whether a given triangulated three-manifold is a three-sphere. The cutting stock problem with a constant number of object lengths. Monotone self-duality. Planar minimum bisection. Pigeonhole subset sum. Determining the result of a comparison between two sums of square roots of integers. Deciding whether a graph admits a graceful labeling. Gap version of the closest vector in lattice problem. The linear divisibility problem. Finding the VC dimension. Clustered planarity.